You are welcome to another video of the course F5 Big IP DNS. In this section, I'm going to talk about F5 LTM DNS load balancing, which distributes DNS queries or traffic across multiple servers, but using Big IP LTM feature. You can also use health monitors, persistent profiles, and I rules to customize load balancing behavior as we have learned in the LTM course. F5 LTM DNS load balancing and F5 DNS load balancing are two different features that allow you to distribute DNS traffic across multiple servers. F5 LTM DNS load balancing uses Big IP LTM feature to load balance DNS traffic locally inside a data center. But F5 DNS load balancing uses Big IP DNS feature to load balance DNS traffic across multiple data center. F5 LTM DNS load balancing uses features like compression, persistent profile, health monitors, and iRules to improve performance, availability, and security of DNS servers, which are discussed in F5 Big IP LTM course. But F5 DNS load balancing uses features like topology-based routing, your location, wide IP, and DNSSEC to optimize user experience, and it will be discussed during this course. This is the topology we will implement in this section. We have a Windows DNS server. For better understanding, I added two DNS servers in the picture, but I use only one DNS server. We then use F5 LTM feature to add a DNS server pool, including DNS servers, with the help of health monitor, we ensure the health of pool members. Finally, we use F5 DNS feature to create a listener that responds to DNS queries. DNS listener forward the queries to appropriate DNS servers in the pool according to the load balancing algorithm configured in LTM feature. Before we implement F5 LTM DNS load balancing, we make sure that DNS server itself is working and Microsoft DNS server is responsible for the zone roika-co.com just for testing purposes I created some A records entries such as host1, host2 and host3.roika-co.com using nslookup we query the DNS server directly for the names host1 roika-co.com or host to.roika-co.com from Microsoft DNS servers with the command nslookup and the server, the IP address of Microsoft DNS server and then host1.roika-co.com or host2 or host3 as you see it is working correctly. Now we add DNS server nodes and pools under DNS delivery and then load balancing and then nodes or pools first we, we create a new node with the name of DNS underline server one with the IP address with the IP address that we have just checked the DNS queries to 234 node default in the health monitor it means health monitor is disabled at node level, but we will enable it at pool level. And then finish. Then we create a pool load balancing, again pool, and then create. And before creating pool, we create a health monitor because we are going to call it in the pool and then create Raika underline DNS underline monitor based on DNS monitor and query for the zone Raika-code.com for reply of any type with no error it means the DNS server is working correctly and then finish and now we create a pool in the pool 
dns underline server underline pool one and the health monitor that we have just created raika dns monitor and we have only one node with port 53 for the dns query and then finish if it is green it means that a status of the dns server or dns pool is right in the pool as you see the status is green that means the microsoft dns server from ltm pool is available by creating nodes health monitor and pools we have used the ltm capability of the five device now let's create a dns listener that uses the dns capability of f5 device in the section dns and the listener we create a new listener with the name of dns underline listener the ip address 192.168.2.105 and for the pool dns server pool one we also make sure that we enable nat to make sure that the return traffic also comes through the f5 device with automap we have already discussed source address translation in big ip device in the course f5 ltm course and it is free to access and then finish now we can verify that the dns listener is working by querying the same a records host one and host two dot .com, but this time through the dns listener and not through the dns server itself not through the dns server itself but this time ns lookup ns lookup server 2105 which is the ip address of f5 dns listener and again has one dot raika dash co dot com you see we are receiving the correct answer that means that dns listener is working correctly and load balance dns queries across different dns server however we have got only one dns server we can also check pool statistics and also dns listener statistics to make sure that it's working correctly in the section pool and statistics you see there are some queries and packets here and also in the section listener and and then again a statistic here also you see some statistic that means listener is working properly